Hey guys, Collector Monica here and welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we will be finishing off our Paldea collection box openings with our final collection box. But before I reveal which Paldea starter we'll be unboxing today. If you're familiar with my videos, you would know who we have left. We gotta do our mandatory nail check. These nails, I did not have them planned for today's video. They were just like a plain nude color earlier this morning. But then I, I started cleaning the house and then got chipped, so I had to repaint them. Because I hate having my nails chipped. So here we are with a more colorful and vibrant color. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it is a hollow sparkly color. It's a nice teal blue shade. And of course, this is Hollow Taco, and this is called, I'm pretty sure it's called Hydro Power. And this is a very nice, almost neon blue. And let me know what you guys think. So guys, today I'm gonna be unboxing some heat. I will be opening the Foy Coco Paldea collection box. Woo! So I know, I'm really late <laughs> with this opening and I've had this for quite a while now, just sitting around. But I just haven't had the time to open it. Finally, we're here. This is the last Paldea starter collection box I have to open. I've already opened the Sprigatito and the Quaxley boxes, so if you'd like to see how my openings went, you can definitely check out the videos up here or in the description down below. I know Foy Coco is a fan favorite from the Scarlet and Violet series or era, um, but to be honest, he's my least favorite of the three. He's kind of cute, but I'm a Sprigatito girl. I don't know if you guys can tell, but yes, yeah, so here we are with our final box and I'm gonna go through it a little bit more quickly only because the content is very similar to the other two. I feel like you guys already seen this before but I'm gonna do it for myself. <laughs> uh, maybe down the road I'll look back at this video but... Yeah so we'll still go through everything but just at a faster pace. So first let's take a look at this beautiful packaging. I've always been a fan of the like mosaic pattern going on and for Foy Coco's box it's obviously a lot more red um you know fire themed for his typing and it's just very beautiful very colorful very vibrant which i love and then when we flip it over you just have a brief description of what is going to be included inside the box and a cute little Foy Coco illustration right there. So guys, I'm gonna open up this box and I'll be right back in just a second. Okay, so this is everything unboxed. So we'll go through each item individually. I'll start off with the oversized or the jumbo card. So for this box, we got the Maridon EX. Like I mentioned before, the jumbo cards, they're just randomly inserted in these boxes. So I'm pretty sure, I forget, but I have the Coridon one too. I forget which box had that one. And then I also got a Maridon in the other box. So now I have two. But yes, this is the jumbo card of the Maridon EX that you can pull from the Scarlet and Violet set. So you can pause, take a look at the sparkle, read his attack. And again, this is not a promo card, just a jumbo version. So there you go. Next up, we'll take a look at the super cute pin. Again, this is one of my favorite items in the collection boxes. This pin is so cute and the quality is really good as well. I have the other two pins here with me. Let me just grab them. So here they are all together. So we have the Sprigatito pin, the Foy Coco pin, and the Quaxley. And they're all a decently good size. And at the back, it does say, like, what does it say? Pokemon. Yeah, Pokemon official pin. So there you go. It's kind of nice to have, and he's super cute. So if you're a big Foy Coco fan, obviously, I recommend picking this up. But yeah, so let me know actually which pin is your favorite. I like Sprigatito. <laughs> But yeah, let me know in the comments down below. Super cute. I like to put them on my tote bags or like 
any of the purses that I bring with me. I stick one of these guys on. Okay, so moving on to the, the three promo cards, not really promo cards. <laughs> So first we'll look at the Spurgatita one quickly, and yes, I will sleeve them, just give me a sec. <laughs> so this is the Spurgatito, um Hollow card. This is the same card you would get in the Scarlet and Violet set, except it's not a rare card, so it's not a hollow card. <laughs> so you'll see here, it's just a common card, but for this collection box, it is a hollow. So there you go. And then the same thing goes with the Quaxly. Typically in the Scarlet and Violet set, he wouldn't be a hollow card, but for this box, he's hollow. So there he is, so cute. And then finally, we have the promo card for Foy Coco. So you'll notice down here on the bottom left, you'll notice the Black Star promo. So if you get one of these cards here, this is just the common symbol and this is the promo symbol. So there you go. And I'll do a side-by-side -side of the common Foy Coco card that you would get in the other two boxes, either for Spurgatito or for Quaxley. And you notice the artwork is different. This one we have Foy Coco shaking his little booty. So let me just leave these three. And I'm just gonna leave the Foy Coco card as well as the pin in the background, just supporting supporting us in today's video. <laughs> so next, of course, is the packs included inside this collection box. You get two Silver Tempest packs and two Brilliant Stars packs. You get a total of four packs. So on this channel, if you're new here, we like to do pack battles every now and then with our openings. We like to do pack battles with our cute little friends right in front of us and so today we will be having a pack battle between Sprigatito and our champion from last video Pikachu! So guys this will be a shorter pack battle since we only have four packs but I don't know let's just see who gets better pulls today. So I'm gonna give Sprigatito the Silver Tempest and this Brilliant Stars pack and then Pikachu will have this Silver Tempest and this Brilliant Stars pack. Let me know down below who you are rooting for for today's video. Are you on Team Sprigatito or are you on Team Pikachu? And so guys, let's ring that bell and let's start today's pack battle. All right, so I'm gonna start with Sprigatito today. I actually wanna do Silver Tempest last, so I'll actually put these underneath and we'll do Brilliant Stars first, so. Here we go, we have a Shaman pack art. How was your guys' Easter? <laughs> was it good? Was it relaxing? Was it nice weather where you are? It's been getting really hot here. <laughs> and I've been drinking a lot of water, a lot of ice water. <laughs> so here we go guys, let's get into this Brilliant Stars opening. We have a Leaf Energy. Cleansing Gloves, Dust Glops, a Bear Tick. Let's even get a Pip Love. You guys, I'm a big fan of Pip Love. If you guys didn't know, if you're new here, we have a Bidoof, Electabuzz, a Halucha, a Dredagon Reverse, and for the rare, a Golurk. So no points here. Let's move on to Pikachu's Brilliant Stars Pack. Oh, that one ripped. Okay. Did I even explain the rules for this <laughs> uh, pack battle? Basically, whoever has the better pulls wins. I think. I did say that. I don't remember. <laughs> there we go. So I kind of miss doing this pack trick, guys. I've been opening Scarlet and Violet, which you should watch my shorts or my ETB openings. Um, and I'm still still rusty. I still forget that you don't have to do a pack trick. <laughs> uh, have you guys been used to it yet? I mean, it's definitely easier, but we shall see. What? We got the same reverse? Hold on, let me, let me grab it. We got the same reverse. And for the rare we got... I don't, I don't like these types of Pokemon. 
So they both have zero points so far, guys. Moving on to our final round, we have Silver Tempest and we have both Lugia pack arts. So pick a side, let me know which Lugia you think is gonna win. I have better pulls. Here we go. Who's still collecting Silver Tempest, guys? I'm just going for singles right now. <laughs> But we still have a couple more cards to go to complete the binder, which let me know if you guys want to see it. It'll be fun. Okay, here we go. Sigalith. Sprigatito, this is your last pack. I think I see something at the end. No spoilers. Curlia. Litten. Come on, Cat Energy. Murkrow. Swablu. We have a Rotom. A Baneri, an Archeops, and Sprigatito's last card is a Magirna V Full Art. I already have this, but it's a full art, so I'm gonna put it in a sleeve. Congrats, Sprigatito. Here we go, it matches the green. Here we go, guys. Last pack for today's video, and Pikachu's last pack. Lugia, which Lugia is gonna win? Can Pikachu pull a better card? We shall see. Here we go. One, two, three, four. To the front. Here we go, guys. I think, yeah. Things for good to also had a fighting energy. Altar. Sunflora. Worker. Growlithe. Pikachu. <laughs> Petalil, Toge Demaru. Come on, can we at least get a. A trainer going? Please. I, I called for it. <laughs> a trainer gallery, Drudagon, and can we get the. <sighs> Guys, there's something at the back. <laughs> Guys, there's something at the back. <laughs> Three, two, one. Guys, that was a good pack. <laughs> okay, let me sleep, let me sleep. I already have these cards, by the way, but they're still good. They're good cards. Actually, have I pulled this? No, right? I feel like I just, I bought this as a single. I don't remember pulling that. I think this one too. Well, there you go. I have doubles now. And Pikachu gets two points. Guys, hold on, let me... Let me clean up here, give me a second. Okay, I'm back, I cleaned up my area for you guys. So let's do a quick recap of today's pack battle and our Paldea collection box opening. So Sprigatito pulled a beautiful Magirna full art from Silver Tempest. And Pikachu got two pulls. Pikachu got the Ho-Oh V, which beautiful card in person even if it's just a v card but of course it's a nice card because it's by the illustrator akira igawa and then we have a trainer gallery this is the dredagon trainer gallery so cute look at him sleeping and there we go so Guys, let me know in the comments down below who you think won today's pack battle. Would you consider Sprigatito's full art a better pull? Or does the quantity matter? Because <laughs> Pikachu pulled two cards. So the Fuecoco box is definitely the best box out of the three Paldea collection boxes. I feel like the other two boxes I didn't really get any hits. <laughs> and this one I got three. So thank you for cool. Anyway guys, I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know it's a little bit shorter than my usual videos, which may be a good thing. I feel you guys like the shorter videos. <laughs> but yeah, if you liked it, leave a like down below and leave a comment down below as well. Let me know what you think and don't forget to subscribe if you want to. I would really appreciate that. And also you can check me out on Instagram at Collector Monica, same way it's spelled here. You can go ahead and get a closer look of my collection and other things that I'm into. That is it for today's video. Again, thank you for joining me and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye!